everybody we are back with some more breath of the wild this is episode three and we did all the intro stuff in the first video and then the second the part two so now we're gonna actually get going with the main plot so it should be a fun time so let's get started all right so we're in the great plateau we have the paraglider now which is great i need to orient myself on where i even am but essentially we have to go toward the like twin peaks or whatever he was talking about which i think is oh yeah it's over there so I just gotta go in that direction, I'm assuming. And then we'll, you know, figure out what's going on over there. Maybe get a horse or something fun. I also need to start finding some Korok. I don't know where they are. I'm not gonna look up anything. I think I'll just find them organically. So if I miss some, maybe at the end I'll like Google where they are. And I do want to find the fairy. There's like a fairy. There's like various different fairies and like hiding places. And I want to find them. I don't know if I ever found all of them, but I think they were fun from what I remember, so that should be cool. We have made it to Hyrule Kingdom. Honestly, the paraglider really just makes all of this so much easier. Oh my gosh, I almost fell. I found the structure, I don't really know. I guess this is like the ruins of the city. I was seeing if there's maybe something hidden, like a chest or something over here. I don't see anything though. But the goal is over here. It's getting over here. I don't even remember how to get a horse. Do you just find them in the wild and like saddle them or something but i'm going on my little adventure it's exciting i also remember there is that guy the like parrot or he's like a bird or something and he like plays the accordion i don't know where he is oh my god is it people oh no those are birds hi birdies should i kill them oh i didn't realize i had fire arrows but okay sorry birdie kind of killed two birds with one stone with that i guess one bird with one arrow uh, uh, okay, sorry. And I do want to do cooking, because cooking is always fun for me in games. Did I get that bug? Oh my god, he outran me. So that should be fun, because I don't think I have many foods. At least not, like, cooked stuff. Okie dokie, what do we have over here? I see some more ruins. It's a little smoky up here. Should I be meant to be following a path? Like, I don't know. It's kind of just, like, open world exploration, I guess. What's up here? Some stairs! Nice! Oh my god, a rock, too. Incredible. Oh! Oh my gosh, our first Kor Korok! Is it Korok? I, I always said Korok, which I think is wrong. These things are so freaking cute. Hi, buddy! Yeah, ha ha, you found me! I'm taking a picture of him for my first one that I find. Huh? You're not Hetsu? Hetsu? Sorry. But you can see me? I didn't know your kind could see the children of the forest. Well, if you run into Hetsu, please return this to him. Is that the giant Korok? I think. Oh, give me a seed. Thank you. I think it is the giant one. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places too. Don't be shy about poking your nose into suspicious places. All right, I guess I'll pick up more rocks if I can find- I keep doing that. If I can find cute little guys like you. Go away, rock. All right, um, buddy, they're so freaking cute. Oh my god, they're so cute. I'm a sucker for like a cute little guy in something. I feel like this game is very much so, it's not the destination, it's the journey and the friends you make along the way. So like, I really gotta like, explore every little nook and cranny. Who's that? Oh, it's a bird. I keep thinking the birds are people. What can I get in this tree? Is there something in this tree? It's a fun looking tree. Some rocks too. What's the- Oh, interesting. Huh. What are these- What are these creatures? Are they like, people? What are these little guys? Oh my. Examine. Oh my gosh, another one! So cute, he's got like a heart-shaped face with his little leaf. Yaha, you found me! Hi, buddy! Bye-bye! Oh my god, adorable. What are these guys? I was wondering what these guys were. These rock things. Oh, they're like old people or something. Little old guys. That's adorable! Okay, oh, the sunset? That's beautiful. Look at that. It's so pretty. Okay. Anyway, I guess I should keep going this way. Lots of little goodies everywhere I go, though. Oh my god, is that like a ram up there? Oh my goodness. Should I kill it? Maybe. Let's see if I can kill it. it. Feels like it's gonna run away. Oh shit, it ran away. Oh, there's a shrine over here. Should I do that shrine? It's like across the river, though. I just flew over that river. But I feel like I should- Oh, there's a bridge there. You know what? We'll do that. I should probably do every shrine that I come across, right? So we should go back and do that. Alright, I made it to this bridge. There's a guy over here. The end is here. Okay. I may be somewhat used to seeing bad omens by now, but that, well, let's just say it's badder than most. What is he talking about? The volcano? We're doomed. I mean, don't panic. Sorry, who are you? Have we met? 
Uh, I'm no one. It doesn't matter. By the by, those strange things that popped out of the ground, did you see that? I'm not talking about mushrooms here. I'm talking about those towers. Oh, yeah, girl. I'm the one that did that. They seem to have popped up all over the place. And that's not the only strange thing that's happened. Those long deserted shrines suddenly started glowing. You know what this means, don't you? The end is here! I mean, this is kind of rational thinking, honestly. With all this craziness happening, I've been keeping an eye on that thing. Just to see if it suddenly starts moving, you know? Is he talking about the volcano or is he talking about the, the castle? What thing? I'm talking about that guardian, of course. Haven't you heard the old stories about Hyrule? Oh, because there's a guardian in the volcano. Oh, wait, no, he's talking about that. Never mind. Isn't there one of the, like, what are they called? The, like, forbidden beast thingies in the volcano? I think there is. See that thing over there? The one shaped like an overturned urn? That is what I'm talking about. You could have been more clear. There's so many things to be concerned about over there. This one here? No, it was a different one. That one was closer to the castle before the forest. When they spot you, they shoot blue beams of light at you. Yeah, I don't like those ones. They're scary. Man, I was so sure that was the end for me. I was prepared for the worst, but I somehow managed to escape into the nearby woods. Do you think it was my lightning fast reflexes that saved me? Girl, I don't know about that. Ha, I wish. To this, I just got lucky. Anyway, I hear guardians like that still wander around Hyrule Castle. Be careful. Oh girl, I will. I will steer clear of those things because I don't freaking like them. They're gross and scary. We made it to the shrine. There's also some skeleton guys chasing me, but we're just gonna quickly go as fast as we can in here and try and dodge them. Go, 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 go. Ah, uh -huh, bitch. Hopefully by the time we come out, it'll be sunlight out, so then they'll be gone. All right, let's see. We're on Bosch Kala. The wind guides you. Uh oh, we gotta figure out this one here. It's not as straightforward as the other ones were. So I guess we have to do something with this wind. Is it gonna- oh oh, it's gonna make me- Go over to the chest, woo! Nice. What'd we get? Amber. What is amber for? I have no idea. Alright, let's see what else do we got. Where else does the wind guide me? Over here. Is this just- it's gonna propel me places? Cause that's pretty easy. Whee! Okay. Oh, am I just supposed to find the end? I assume it's something along those lines. What's up here? Oh, another thing. That takes me backwards, so we should keep going this way. Through here. Oh, there's another chest. Oh no! 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 I wasn't expecting me to take me that far. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I'm totally dead. Correct. I mean, it seems like this is the wind current I'm supposed to take, but I guess just not that direction. Since the chest is that way, should I like fly? No, maybe not. Oh god. Oh no, I fumbled it again. Yeah, I'm a pro gamer. Like, I meant to do that. So. Oh my god, I'm gonna freaking die. Let me just try going straight. Is there a way to alter the? See, that doesn't seem right because I need to get the. The freaking tr treasure. I guess I need to alter the wind current somehow. Is there anything I can use my powers on? Oh! Stop time. Hmm. I definitely need to think this through somehow. So let's go back over here. Maybe I need to stop time on this one and then fly across here? Like, that seems. Like, I'm not gonna make it. Yeah. I literally don't know. I thought it was gonna be easy. Wait, I'm gonna try this way. Oh. Oh, oh, big money. Big money. Oh my gosh. Okay, I figured it out. Well, I mean, I guess trial and error. And I didn't look it up, so that's- Oh, I got a sword? That's great. Oh, my inventory's full. Oh. I'm not gonna cheat and look stuff up unless it's, like, really hard. And that one, I honestly was so close to looking it up because I was like really struggling, but we figured it out and that's what matters and that's what counts. I drop that one. Get the sword. Nice. I mean, I guess this room is called Let the Wind Guide You, so I guess that makes sense for how you get that treasure. Okay, well we got it though, we're good. Anyway, give me that spirit orb, girly. Your resourcefulness in overcoming this trial speaks to the promise of a hero. Give me that orb, baby. 
go inside of me. Ooh, thank you. Now I only have one spirit orb because I gave all those away. May the goddess smile upon you. Hey, and would you look at that? It took me so long. Why did I get a side quest? It took me so long to do that trial that it's daytime now. Let's check what that side quest is. The southern sky from the middle of the largest bridge, the eastern sky- what? Look to the night sky at these locations, find the red shooting star. Go what? I'm supposed to go in this way anyway, okay. We're, we're gonna go back towards these twin peaks, as they told me to do. Alright, on my adventure, here we go. I wonder if that dude is still on the bridge or if he left. Oh, he's still there, I think. Or he's leaving. Or is it a different person? I have no idea. The same dude? It is the same dude. Good to know. I'm just gonna start throwing rocks at people. Take that! Oh, I messed up again. This is my my plan for Ganon. Take that, Ganon! Oh no, I should've taken that bug! Or whatever the frick that was. Birdies! All the animals run away from me. Alright, so I know I'm supposed to be going that way, but this is a little bit intriguing. Whatever this is. Let's go! We Oh, there's mushrooms and- Oh! Oh, that was totally uh, one of those guys, the Korok. Gotta follow it! There's a boulder, they're trying to kill me! Oh my goodness. Blue nightshade. Cool, pretty flowers. Let's keep going! Where are you, little buddy? Oh! Up here, up here. Up here. I'm coming for you! Right here. Big money! Ah! Cute little guy! Yeah, hi, you found me! Thank you for the seed. Bye bye! Bye, little buddy. Alright, so we're gonna keep going this way. Seems to be a sign here. Proxim Bridge, Dueling Peak Stable. Oh, stable! Oh, are we gonna get a horse? Oh my god. That's exactly what I need. A freaking horse. Should I, like, cut a tree down or something? For no reason? Woo! Oh, acorns! It wasn't for no reason, we got acorns! Dope, I got one acorn from that whole tree. Awesome, awesome. Take. Hey, what is it? Hightail lizard! That's a little bit fun. Is it gonna be my new pet? Every animal I find slowly becomes my new pet. Where's a stable though? Oh my god. It's a majestic... Oh, damn it, it's running away. A deer, I think, or a stag. Alright. Mushroom, silent shroom. All right, there's some campsite up here. I wonder if it's enemy or foe. Wait, oh. that was both the same thing. Friend or foe? <laughs> enemy or foe? Who's there? It's a human. Fucking rock. I guess it's a good guy. Oh my god, he has a pot. I can cook stuff, even though it's not lit. Can I steal this? Oh. Hey there, why are you planning on going with my axe? I mean, did you not just see me chop that dope ass tree? I kind of need it. It's okay, you can have it. Sorry for hauling at you like that. Oh my god, people are so easy to just give away their personal belongings. Like, oh, you took my axe? Okay, you can have it. It's just the times we live in. No one's gonna get mad if you pick up something that's just lying around. If something is important to someone, they wouldn't let it out of their sight. By the way, I mean, he's sitting right next to it. I shouldn't have taken it. I feel bad now. I'm a traveling merchant. Name's Jiro. Nice to meet you. Jiro, you're a merchant, you say? Can you give me, like, items? I venture into the forest to get my wares. Oh, but I also buy them from travelers. Okay. You make some moolah. So do you happen to have anything rare you'd be interested in selling? I mean, I guess. Great, let's see what you got. I don't know what's good to keep and what's good to sell. Oh, I have a frog. I want to keep that, though. Eyeballs are pretty good price. 20? I don't have any rupees. Is it rupees in this game? Is that what the currency is? Maybe we'll sell the eyeballs. Alright, we got 40 rupees. Hell yeah. And what about... Uh, do, oh, this sells for a lot, the amber, but we get those from treasure chests, so I feel like maybe it would be smart to keep them. I don't know if they're good for anything, so... But I am interested to see what he is selling. I'm proud of my wares, all of them. Please take a look. Truffle, carrot... Oh, that would be good for a horse, right? I don't know what you give to a horse. Mushrooms, rock salt, arrows would be good. Maybe I'll get some arrows. Oh wait, I only bought one. What? Only one is 20? Never freaking mind. I don't know. I don't have the money for this. No thanks, buddy. Your prices are a little inflated. You be careful. You hear? Okay, Jiro. I'll be. I'll be careful. Okay. Oh my god! I just got a rupee from picking up a rock. 
Slay. Okay, let me try and cook something though. Let me like change my weapon. Do I have a torch? No. There it is. Nice, nice. We have a cute little fire now. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm whistling. Anyway. You can pass time by the fire. No, I want to cook something. How do I cook? Do I just throw shit at it and then it's like, I'm making stuff? Oh, like that. Oh my god, what a funky beat. Oh my god, sauteed nuts just from one acorn? That was amazing. I guess every item I have, it's better if it's cooked, so I'll just fucking throw all my shit in there. What do we got? Mushroom skewer. Nice. Do I have to do one at a time? Or no, I can do five. Five at a time. Oh wait, no, I made one super powered mushroom skewer. I didn't do one at a time. Okay, shit. Now I got like a dope mushroom skewer here. Wow, I don't even have that many hearts. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to save that one. Is this even interesting? Let's do this one. A different kind of mushroom. I wonder if it'll be the same mushroom skewer or if it'll be like a green one or something. It's probably gonna be the same one though. Oh, it's an energizing one. Okay, green is energy. Okay. Let's see what else do I have to cook. Um, 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 chili peppers, spicy peppers. Let's see what we got here. Oh, spicy sauteed peppers. Okay, that's good for being cold. I guess I should make a few of those if I'm gonna be in the tundra or anywhere cold. Spicy sauteed peppers for 12 minutes. That's all you really need. You can do anything in 12 minutes. All right, let's see what else we got here. Squirrel. I'll leave you be. Another mushroom. What is that noise? Some funky noises in this game. I should go to this tower. How misleading though, it said there was a stable in this direction. I have yet to see a single horse. How far this way? Oh my God. A slime. Oh wait, I have my freaking torch out. Well, how far is the stable in this direction? Like, why would you have the sign so early on? Choo choo jelly. How cute. Oh my god, there's deer. They're running around. How cute. Where's the freaking horses is what I'm wondering. Okay. I climbed up here because I saw this little windmill. I think this has something to do with the Korok or something. Oh no, I definitely don't have the arrows for this. Oh god. I'm already flopping. That was all my arrows. How am I supposed to get that? Shoot. Do I have to buy arrows from that guy? I might have to come back and do this if I mark this on my map. How do I get to the map? I forgot everything. I guess I'll just, you know, mark my location here and we'll come back here at some point. Right? Is this where I am? I guess I don't have the map fleshed out, so it's kind of hard to tell. Once I get this tower, it should show up on the map. I guess we'll follow this Korok to the... The other side. Can I swim good? Probably. Oh no, not against this current. Uh oh. Shit, I'm gonna have to take a different approach. Why is the current so strong though? Also, what is this building? Is this evil? It looks evil. Nobody over here though. Apples! I shall investigate. Oh, there's a chest! Nice. Flint. Just need some steel and I can make a, 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 a to go to the nether portal. What is it called? A flint and steel? Start at the very end of the river here. See if I can get across. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we did it. I just have to walk along the shore. All right, here it is. And that Korok is somewhere out here. Oh, it's back all the way over there, isn't it? Well, I'll have to get that a different time. Maybe I'll mark this on my map to come back to it. Um, it's like right here. All right, you know, good enough. <laughs> Let's just get to this tower. To the tower! I guess I gotta climb my little booty up here. It's nighttime though, it's kind of scary. There hasn't been a blood moon yet, which I'm a little bit scared for that. But I do want to find a horse. I don't really care what color it is, but I do like the orangey brown color because then I can name it Spirit from the Spirit movie. It's like I climb all the way to the top and it's like the activator is actually on the bottom of the tower. Idiot. I'm pretty sure it's up here though. Here it is, this thing.
she get tower activated. Beautiful. Wow, magical. Now I can teleport here, which is good. Scanning area. And put it into my Shika tablet. Nice. Let's see how big. It's an interesting spread of area. Oh, there's like a path. Okay. Shika sensor. The sensor reacts when you are close to shrines that you have not yet visited. If you head in the direction where the reaction is strongest, you'll be able to find the shrine. Okay, so it'll help me find shrines, which is good. You can enable or disable the Shika sensor with Y on the map screen. Shika sensor now operational. Oh my gosh, it's already working. The sensor indicator has been placed near the mini map. Search for shrines by moving in the direction with the strongest signal. Gotcha. It would appear there's a shrine nearby. I'm just trying to find a stable though. Can it tell me where the nearest stable is? That's all I want. Bad guys are right there. Good to know. In the distance there's a shrine. Should I? I'm sure there's many shrines. There's a tower over there. Okay, we got the freaking volcano, mountain. I don't see any horse stables. Anyway, saying there's a shrine nearby. I don't really care to do that. I'm just trying to find the horses. T B freaking H. But it's saying the horses are this way, so I guess I should just carry on this way. It's really beeping, isn't it? Can't tell if it's annoying or helpful. Oh gosh, I'm kind of scared actually because it's nighttime. This feels like a sketchy area. Oh, but this rock is glowing. Can I harvest it or? Oh, it's amber. Good to know. Oh my god, I keep doing that where I accidentally freaking whistle. For when I get a horse, I'll be doing that a lot. What is that noise? Oh, there's a shrine. Oh my god, there's like scary Lyle crocodiles in the water. And there's a shrine right there. Should I go to this shrine? I mean, I feel like I should, right? This must be the one that my uh, Sheikah Slate is telling me about. Let's see, can I climb that high? I probably can. If I can climb that tall mountain to get to that other shrine, I think I can climb this one. This is just a baby mountain. Oh yeah, we'll be good. Maybe there'll be a horse inside the shrine. There won't be. I'm just really dead set on getting a horse all of a sudden. I can't help it, I like horses, what can I say? Alright, let's see what we have to do with this shrine. I'm hoping it's easy. Reed De Hay, is that what it said their name was? Timing is critical. It seems like I'll need my stopping time thing, right? Oh. Okay, there's a ball in that thing. Oh. I did it, I guess. <laughs> Take the little elevator over. So I'm just stepping on these like pressure plate thingies and then stuff is happening. Like a Rube Goldberg machine or something. Oh, okay, okay, I get this one. And then it rolls down. Oh, it's like golf, kind of, too, because you gotta get it in the goal. Oh, I'm so smart. There we go. Oh, wait, let me go on the little thing. Okay. Nice. It's like I've played this game before. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory, though. How do I get the chest? There's something I'm missing. You know what? I think I figured it out. So if I step on here, it's like slanted, right? So if I like stop time on this thing and then jump over here, hopefully that is enough time. It doesn't seem like it is. Oh god, it doesn't seem like it is. Oh, frig. No! Is that what I need to do though? That seems too hard. This is gonna be stressful because I have to stand on it so that it goes down. And then I need to stop time, but that thing is flying away. So I gotta stop. Oh wait. Can I move? Can I move something? To put on it? Like this? Oh, like if I- okay, if I get a- if I get a barrel, I can put it on top of it? Maybe? It seems so complicated, but we'll try it. We get this barrel. Right? And then put it on there. You know, like, like that. Oh my god! Oh my god! I almost died. Oh my god, but I did it though. 
<laughs> That's what I need to do. Dope. I'm so big brain. Big brain. Climber's bandana. Oh my gosh, I get a fun hairstyle or hat. Best? No, I'm putting that on. Okay, dope. Very cute, Linky boy. But now I need to take the barrel off because I need to kind of get up here. Is that too far away? How is it too far now? I literally just did it. Oh god. I'm scared. You know what? I'm just gonna like hang glide over here. Hopefully that does not work. Nope. Okay. I'll just go back over here. And take the stupid barrel off. There we go. Alright, now give me that spirit orb. Nice. I look so cool now with my little bandana. How fun. Cool. Okay, so I think we're gonna stop here for today. I do want to get a horse, but I guess it'll just be maybe next video, hopefully, because I cannot find the freaking stable. I thought it was gonna be closer than it is. So we're gonna stop here so the video is not too long. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, gamer!